What only exists to f*** with all of us? McAfee Antivirus Tried to tell me that The Sims 4 was dangerous out of nowhere. Got a new computer with it already installed. Played The Sims for a few days. And it suddenly became dangerous like. It's dangerous because it shows you very unnatural things that are bad for your mental health. Things like one having a job and a family with a nice house. The share button on porn sites. The only porn that I know of that gets shared involves two female humans and one drinking apparatus. One drinking apparatus. A water fountain. S. The ads that have the X inside the ad, so that when you click to close it, it takes you to the linked site. Honestly WTF do they think will happen I wasn't going to download your speed T mobile game with an ad that has nothing to do with gamma play, but wow you tricked me into going to your website. I think I will give it a try. If SMBD pays for the amount of people who clicked on ad, that's the only way why this trickery exists. Robber calls about your car's extended warranty. I get these several times a week. I don't even own a f peeping car. My partner gets these robo calls and she's never had a driver's license. Bed bugs. They have no ecological benefit and target only humans. Almost exclusively, just when the human hosts are sleeping. Armed with natural anticoagulants and painkillers for enhanced, stealthy blood sucking. 8 We need a dragon's breath shotgun and the doom guy. Did I mention that bed bugs normally strike only in darkness? They are nearly invisible when young. They've mastered the art of hiding. They're immune to common insecticides. And they'll wait months more than a year in some cases without any nourishment, while patiently waiting for feeding opportunities. Doom guy has never faced an enemy with such exceptional clandestine tactics. I know they weren't meant to and once had a reason to exist, but by now, wisdom teeth. I don't have a single wisdom tooth. My dentist said he could count on one hand how many times he came across that. Undefined. I don't have any either. I was so confused in school when everyone was complaining, having to get them remobbed undefined. <laughs> Cancer. Seriously. It's not something foreign, like an animal or poorly made printers. It's the own body system completely losing control of cell management. Our tech and advancements in science has only touched what a cure might look like. Cancer is the only answer here. R.I.P. Mama. Edited a word. Shout out to you slash backsaber for being a star player. Edit. North peep that. At my misspelled mess. Our bodies are fighting cancerous mutations all the time. And 99. 99% of the time they're successful. It's that other 0. 0.1% that causes problems. The corner of my bed that sticks out. It has no other purpose other than giving a world of pain to my porto. Map. It has a purpose. If that corner weren't there, your bed would go on forever. Op. I didn't think of that. Fake pockets on clothing. As man. This isn't something I have to worry about usually, but the first time it happened I felt so out to be a damn into an existential crisis wondering why I keep flipping the stupid flap up expecting a pocket to magically appear. Or it was a jacket. Was there a pocket lining on the inside? Sometimes the pockets are sewn shut to keep the pockets flat for shipping and sale, which is marginally less stupid but still terrible. Lice. How come I get lice and nothing happens to Millhouse? Animals that are just slightly smarter than you expected. They always manage to f*** with your head, but are still dumb enough that you know they aren't doing it on purpose. I don't know how my dog managed to learn to turn light switches off on his own. But all he's done with his power so far is scare himself when it suddenly gets dark. Oh I know some animals do things to you out of spite. Used to have a fish African cichlid, bumblebee variety that was entirely too smart for his own good. I get to feed him around the same time every day. He has scooping rocks in his mouth and spit them at the filter intake so it inevitably sucks one up and makes ungodly noises, so you pay attention to him and feed him. You're supposed to rearrange their tank every now and then so they stop being so territorially aggressive. 
yay he took it out on your hand. If you were about to put something he absolutely did not want it. Or if you were quick about it, and buried things. So he cold and scoop all the rocks out, and make it float he would utterly bury it in rocks. Once he would not stop burying the filter pipe. I had to rearrange the tank back how it was then he was fine. Most interesting yet annoying fish I've ever had. Cichlids are hella smart man. I had an Oscar cichlid in a tank with much smaller fish. Not small enough for Oscar to eat though. Anyways. Sometimes I'd throw in a couple Dorito chips and the smaller fish would try and eat the chips. But they were too big for them to eat. So my Oscar fish would come out of his cave and break up the chips to smaller bits. So the smaller fish could eat some. Single ply toilet paper. Might as well wipe your ass with your bare hand. TBH. Just gotta fold it fold it some more. Asking for credit card info for free trial. It's only a free trial, if you remember to unsubscribe. A free trial is a free trial. Paying option or any pay in info shouldn't be there. Credit scores. Used to be that the bank would do their due diligence on loan applications before offering terms that made sense for each person. Now they've contracted a huge system where missing one bill payment can peep you over and paying down debt early is, can be interpreted as a bad thing. The idea in principle isn't so bad. But the way it's implemented is stupid and unwieldy and mistakes are far too hard to correct. I couldn't get approved for a mortgage due to missing a bill by two weeks from two years ago so now I pay 400 more in rent a month than the mortgage would have been. I know where you're coming from. My credit sucks because I didn't have insurance for a year but have a chronic illness. Now there's a 3k collection for one blood test. At this rate I'm just going to rent until I die. DJ bus. I've just been in this place before. Higher on the street. Dildos. That's deep man. That's what she said. Mosquitoes. They got a buzz in your ears, just to add insult to injury. They really are Satan's bug. Printers. Now I hear you saying to me oh, but wait printers are so useful. Nope. They were all sent from hell to haunt us. Office printers are bad. Home printers are worse. They never work. Need 300 different drivers you have to get off the website. Oops is we don't make that one anymore. Oh no. The ink we gave you was a trial size. Guess what asshole no store sells the bastard random number your printer needs. But you can buy this replacement for 60 bucks that will print maybe 2 pages properly. Stop buying inkjet printers. The only PPL who need ink printers are people looking to print high quality pictures. Laser printers don't clog slash dry up nearly as badly as ink printers do, and print literally thousands of pages on a cartridge. And the ink doesn't cost more than human blood. Inkjet printers are such a peeping scam. I swear to god my aunt had an all-in-one printer slash copier slash fax thing and nothing would work if one of the cartridges was out. I don't know if it's common practice, but it blew my mind. I just need to scan this document. Peep you. Give me magenta. But I don't want to actually print it. I just need to scan it, so I can send it in an airmail. Peep you give me magenta. That girl in Pokemon who trades you a horn to that's holding a god of Everston. Our tax system. In the U. S. Anyway. Most places don't have such confusing taxes. Usually it's just a bill that comes, that you gotta pay. This is very possible and doable in America. In fact in the past 20 years both a Democrat and a Republicans on two separate occasions proposed a bill that would simply tax his so literally anyone could do it. The problem is it would cost a lot of accountants and jobs. So, America, in its never dying love of retaining jobs that have no reason to exist outside of providing work, has never implemented a more simple tax system. That and H&R Block spends millions of dollars every year to make the tax code more complicated, so people will have to relay on some big company to do it for them. And yet another example of a big giant company purposefully making the government incompetent so that they can replace the government and charge citizens to do what you legally have to do every year. That would cost a lot of accountants some jobs. As an accountant public auditor, 
not tax accountant. Go ahead. Change it. I'm from the Netherlands and the tax system is much easier here. And there's still plenty of work too much to be able to handle actually.